Online and blended learning, and I think both those terms are important because we keep looking at the careful, judicious combination of on-site and online in blended. I think what it allows, what it enables universities to do is to really address and fulfill their mission contemporaneously, meaning that they can start addressing their mission of providing learning, providing learning services, providing offerings to a much more, much wider audience and a much more diverse audience so that they do not have to be limited just to meeting the needs of traditional learners, but non-traditional learners, differently aged learners, differently prepared learners, so that they can serve uh, these kinds of learning needs on a continuous basis. And what it does is it renders universities to be much more flexible in the way that they develop educational programs and deliver educational programs. When you think about impact, the impact uh, is not just in terms of being able to serve many more, but also serve them better. One of the things that we see with the online and blended learning is the fact that it allows you for, to first look at how you have been educating your learners in the first place and be able to look at that and see what kinds of changes that need to be made so that you can effectively employ technology. For, for instance, uh, to have much more formative assessment so that people can master learning master subjects much better, uh, to be able to see how you can meet students who come not only with different preparations, but different aspirations, different motivations, so that you can adjust or provide much more adaptive, personalized learning opportunities for these learners uh, in a more relevant way. And when I say relevance, it means much more uh, so that their preparation is much more aligned, let's say, to their aspirations in higher education or to labor market needs so that they can be uh, uh, more employable. Our tendency is initially is to say that we are just going to take what we are doing uh, usually and plant it on something digital. And I think uh, in order for online and blended to be really impactful, you have to really rethink, re-engineer what we are teaching, how we are teaching, and thereby address who we are offering learning opportunities to.